Good morning, everyone. This morning, I'd like to share from Second Kings 17, and it reads, And Elijah prayed, Open his eyes so that he may see. Then the Lord opened the eyes of the servants, and he looked and saw the hill full of horses and chariots of fire all around Elijah. Let us pray. Dear Lord, there is anarchy in the land. There is confusion just like in this day of Elijah. Lord, I pray that you stir your people's hearts towards prayer. I pray that you open our eyes to see what you are doing. And most importantly, I pray for victory according to your will. In Jesus' name, amen. In this passage, there was an army coming to take over the land. And Elijah, who had worked with God, knew the Lord that he served. And he knew that God was going to make them win. But the people did not know. Some of them were afraid. Some of them were distraught. And Elijah prayed. Just like a lot of people are praying concerning Nigeria right now. Elijah prayed. And secondly, the Lord answered. I just want to remind someone that God does answer. He does answer. He still answers. And God answered and he opened the eyes of the servants, of the people. And they saw that God was there. I pray that as we are all praying, the eyes of the people will be open. Everybody facing mental breakdown at this time, I pray that your hearts are healed. That your eyes are open to see the move of God over our nation, Nigeria. I pray for the people in Ghana. I pray for the people with child trafficking in Ghana. I pray for the people in South Africa. I pray for the people in Democratic Republic of Congo. I pray for all these nations that the Lord will open our eyes to see his mighty hand and that the hearts of the people will be healed. If you are watching me today and you are just overwhelmed with social media, trust me, I was overwhelmed. I couldn't sleep. 20, 20th of October 2020 was a lot. But please, let's follow the word. Let's guard our hearts. If you need to drop your phone for some time, social media, please do. Let's guard our hearts. But most importantly, I pray that the Lord opens your eyes to see that his mighty hand is over Nigeria. He's over Ghana. He's over South Africa. He's over Democratic Republic of Congo. And I pray that your heart is healed. There are some numbers at the end of this video. If you want someone to just talk with you, pray with you, please send a text message or a WhatsApp message to this number and somebody will reach out to you. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Bye.